Hello YouTube, Eugene Johnson here again, aka Mortician Man 24. And just wanted to let you guys know I checked out the teaser trailer for the new Evil Dead remake. Wow. Why are they doing this stuff? I mean, why can't they just leave well enough alone? Uh, the Evil Dead was made back in 1979 or 80, I can't remember which. But it was one of the top horror movies of that time and still is today in my opinion. As a matter of fact, I bought the box set. Uh, it's got three discs in it. It's called the Ultimate Edition. I bought it back in the summer off of Amazon. And to be completely honest with you, I will not be seeing the remake at all. I'll probably get it when it comes out on DVD. But I know for a fact that it cannot hold up to the original, and I don't see why Hollywood's still going around making these things. I will probably more likely take take a look at the Texas Chainsaw 3D remake. I don't know if it's a remake or not, but I'd say more likely it will follow that category. But um, I will not be checking out the Evil Dead till DVD, and uh, but I'll probably see the Texas Chainsaw 3D in theaters this January. Um, when I do, I will uh, come back after I, as soon as I see the movie and make a video about how it was. I won't give away anything in case you guys do want to see it, but. Um, I've uh, been a Chainsaw fan for many years now, and uh, I will continue to be the, a fan, but uh, the all-time two favorites that I have is Gunnar Hansen and uh, Bill Johnson, and I really enjoyed R.A. Mihailov, too. So, um, but anyway, that's, that's all I wanted to say. I mean, if you guys see it, the Evil Dead remake, if you guys see it when it comes out, it comes out in the spring, I think, of 2013. So if you guys see it, uh, post in the comments down there what, what it's about and if it's any good because I will not be seeing it till DVD. But that's all I wanted to say, and I wanted to tell, you know, whoever's making these things that you suck because you're just tampering with stuff that doesn't make any sense. It's no, there's no need for a remake of The Evil Dead. There's no need for there was wasn't really a need for Nightmare on Elm Street remake either. That movie I thought was horrible. Uh, there's only one person that's Freddy Krueger, and that's Robert England. Robert England wasn't in it. There is no Freddy. That's all my opinion. And I mean, but if you keep making these things, they're going to keep turning out stupid. Uh, the Friday the Thirteenth remake I enjoyed a little bit. The Halloween remake, it was really good except part two. I did not like part two at all. And the thing that I do not understand was why in the hell did you have to have a seven-foot Michael Myers? All the movies that I've seen him in, yeah, the tallest guy I think that played him was George P. Wilbur at six foot six. That's fine. But seven feet tall, he's not a basketball player. He's a killer. But anyway, guys, I just wanted to give you my thoughts on that crap that's coming out. So, but if you need, I mean, if you're looking to me to review the movie, it's not going to happen because I'm not watching it. Uh, January 4th, though, I will have a review on Texas Chainsaw 3D. We'll see how that goes. But anyway, you guys have a good night. Have a good day tomorrow. Keep it horror.